Hi, in this video I want to introduce you to a new trick that I advise in order to improve my focusing experience on, with manual lenses, with long telephoto lenses on stars. So this is a Canon 300 uh, millimeter, is an old FD lens, and this is my APL, uh, Olympus APL Micro Four Third camera. So the combination gives me a field of view that is equivalent to a 600 millimeter lens on a full frame camera. This gear is mounted on a simple Manfrotto ball head and uh, a um, Manfrotto 055 X Pro B. The tripod is sturdy enough for normal photography, but we will see that when we do focusing with long telephoto lenses, then some vibrations are introduced to the image. So how we do proceed? The first thing is, as, as usually, if we want to focus on star, the idea is to magnify the star on the live view. So let's suppose that the star is, the, is, is that simony over there. And so let's go to magnify it. Now you see that it is rather in focus. Um, the idea is, the problem is that when I'm going to manipulate my lens, and so I'm, I'm touching the lens now, you see that I have quite a lot of vibration and all when I'm focusing, you see that the image is wobbling quite a lot in the, in the, in the screen. Now this lens has a very, very, very smooth and light focus ring. Others are more, um, more hard they to turn so the vibration will be even larger so it will be something like of this sort now how we can avoid this the idea is to use a tube ring like the one you use to fix a guiding scope to a telescope to mimic the device the video makers uh, apply to their own lens in order to have a smooth transition between one focus plane and another so the effect of having this kind of rings here and the, the screw that is far away from the lens is that the focus throw, the actual focus throw is increased. So a larger movement on my hand corresponds to a smaller movement of the ring. And so it's easier to make uh, micro adjustment, but also I don't have to touch the lens. I just can grab hold this screw and rotate my focusing ring. So let's see how this, um, affect the focusing experience. So let's go back to magnify our stars on the live view. Now I am manipulated the lens directly. This is the amount of vibration I can have when I manipulated the lens directly. So now let's go completely out of focus. And now I will hold this screw and I will do my adjustment. And here we go. So you see that the I was turning to the other side, sorry. So, okay, I'm still using the device. You see the image is getting into focus, vibration free. So let's go to do a precise focusing. There you go. You see minim the image is as sharp as it can get. There is no chromatic aberration. I'm still changing the focus with very little vibration. And so this simple trick can really make a difference when you try to focus precisely on stars. And I hope you have enjoyed this video and let me know in the comment if it worked for you. Bye.